Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Shroom Ma Kitchen. And today I'm going to be showing you how to make chaga tea. So, we do carry the chaga chunks now at the Shroom Room. I use about a half a bag and put them into a large pot with some purified clean water. Chaga has been known for all kinds of health benefits, definitely anti aging. It's a very soothing tea. I love it. Whether you take it hot or cold or just room temperature, it's just a wonderful, calming, relaxing tea. I do like to add some extra spices into my chaga tea and I kind of follow the realm of the chai spice. I use a little vanilla bean, uh, cinnamon, star anise, black pepper, you can do cardamom, cloves. It really is just a personal preference as far as what you want to add into your chaga tea. It's wonderful on its own and really doesn't need any extra spices, but this is something that I like to do periodically just to mix it up a little bit. So once that's simmered on the stove for a few hours, I go ahead and pull it off and strain out all of the chaga chunks and spices. What you will be left with is this amazing, dark, warm, soothing tea that you can then drink right away or you can keep it on the counter for a few days if you like it room temperature you can put it in the refrigerator and heat it up any time of day that you're ready for a chaga tea it's just so nice to have a large batch of this tea waiting for me at home because it's ready whenever i am the other thing i really appreciate about the chaga is that it is reusable after I've done making the tea, I'll take the chaga and the spices and set them out to dry and seal them away for the next time I'm ready to make up a batch. If you'd like to try making chaga tea at home, we do sell the chaga chunks now at the Shroom Room. Mention that you saw the video and you can get a free sample of our chaga tea and we really hope that you enjoy it as much as we do. Thank you for your support.